What's up, ladies and gentlemen? I'm Vigilante watching the Vigilante Effect, and today I have a double unboxing for you. I have Cyberpunk 2077. I decided to get it for the Xbox um, because I'm going to be playing it on the Xbox Series X. I heard there's a lot of problems on the PS4, and um, the PS5 is crashing with it, so I'm hoping I'm going to get some better results on the Xbox Series X. And I'm going to do some gameplay testing between the Xbox One X and the Xbox Series X to see if there's any actual issues. Uh, because I'm hearing the base um, platforms, which is the original Xbox One, not the Xbox One X um, from what I'm hearing, and the original PS4, again, not the PS4 Pro, are having some issues running this game. Um, but in any case, there was a lot of advertisement for it with, by Microsoft and Xbox. So I decided, you know what, let me get it for the Xbox. I also have here the Cyberpunk controller um, for the Xbox. Now, this, go, this works for the Xbox One and for the Xbox Series X as well. Um, I bought this a couple of months ago. I just never opened it up waiting for the game. So let's, uh, let's give this a try. So I'm going to do a little bit of an incision... I did a little one right here. Let's see if I can do one right here. And then just peel it open. Okay. Let me put this one to the side for a second. Let me take that one out. And let's see what comes in here. So obviously you have the case. Uh, I'm guessing there's a map in here somewhere. So this looks like a postcard. It's pretty cool. A manual? Oh my God. <laughs> That's awesome. Is that a manual? It looks like a manual, yeah. This is a, or maybe a history, a little bit of the history of the, uh, the city that we're going to be playing in. Excuse the language there. Yeah, it looks like a little bit of a manual. That is awesome. And I'm guessing this is, yeah, this is like a map. So I'm, I'm not going to be able to open it up here, but essentially it opens up. It looks like the map of the city. Whoops. I'm going to be using that real quick. <laughs> so this is a HBO Max start your 30 day free trial. It's funny because the pre-order came with a 14 day free trial of HBO Max. Now this is a 30 day free trial that comes automatically with the game. So... I don't know. Is that 45 days? <laughs> we'll see. Let me take this out. So this is the back. It's rated M. Ooh, need another incision here. Obviously, you have the game. Technical support. And these look like stickers. Yeah. Nice. That's awesome. I'm, I'm really happy with the content already that's coming with this. And this is a reversible cover, as you can see. All right. Let's uh, get to the controller. C -c -c controller. Woo. My back is killing me. Woo. Oh my god. Uh. Maybe I should have sat down for this. All right. Let's uh, open up this controller right here. So I think 
there's one place all oh, right there it is okay this should open it up kind of opening it at an angle so I'm kind of struggling here uh, it's kind of the way I'm seated with all right there we go this is gonna be a nice view you ready for this BAM and this is my target receipt I always put my receipts uh, in a way where I can relocate them down the line it's just I guess for memory for me and just for um, preser preservation purposes so I find a way to just kind of stick it through uh, to keep it there until I opened it. So, in any case, this is the controller. I'm going to take it out, give you guys a better view. It actually comes with, uh, it comes with the batteries. And the box, as you can see, it's a pretty cool box. I love the art direction on here. And here's the controller. Look at that. It has all these realistic scratch marks. It looks like it's actually scratched. I think, yeah, it is actually scratched over here. Um, you know, by design, obviously. Um, this is the back of it. It feels really good right here. Really good. And then here, these are the regular triggers for the Xbox One. This is an Xbox One controller. Um, this is not an Xbox Series S controller or, or Series X controller either or um, and I'll show you the difference here this is the original Xbox one controller I have that for my Xbox one X and it's the same size see everything is the same the only difference is here um, it does have a little bit of a rugged you know feel but it's not it's not you know prominent here it's almost like rubberized I think this is actually, if it's not rubber, it really feels like rubber. It feels really good. It allows you to grip much easier. Okay. Um, now, the Xbox Series X controller is essentially, is essentially the same thing. The only big difference is you have the D-pad here. It kind of has like a clicky sound as opposed to here. This is more clicky. And then it has obviously the corners, right? Like it's one big piece. Um, and also the back, this is different from the um, Xbox One controllers. The Xbox One does have some rugged, you know, a rugged feel over here, but it's not nearly as prominent as this. And also the Xbox Series X controller has it over here as well. All right. Now, if I'm comparing the two controllers, This one has it all around. This one has it on the inside. And it's way more prominent here. It feels like rubber. But let me see how it feels in the hand. Okay. Yeah. So I, I think it's easier to hold this one right here. Uh, in terms of grip, you have a better grip on the um, Cyberpunk 2077 uh, controller. And I mean, come on, this looks freaking awesome. Like if I was to use this while I'm playing the game, I'm 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 excited to try it. Uh, and obviously the other big difference is this middle, this middle button right here. I don't remember exactly what it does to be honest. I think it's a share button if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I think it. This is the share button. Um, so here you don't really have it, but it doesn't. You still have the same functions. You know, you can just it's just going to take a little bit longer, uh, where you have to manually go in and press share through the system itself as opposed to here you can just press it right away and again both controllers are forward compatible backwards compatible they both work with all systems so this will work with the xbox one xbox one x etc this will work with the xbox one x xbox one and the xbox series x or s um so 
yeah, both work. So anyway, that's been my unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to let you know what I think of the gameplay um, as soon as I get a chance to play it. I didn't actually put it in yet. I'm hoping that I don't have, you know, many bugs uh, on my copy of the game um, or on the Series X. And uh, yeah, I'll keep you guys posted and look out for that uh, PS5 review, the Xbox Series X review. I've been playing them for about a month now. I did get them on release day. Um, I just uh, wanted to give some time uh, for me to make a better or have a better opinion on both of them before I said anything. Uh, but uh, if you guys like this video, please subscribe and uh, give it a thumbs up and uh, peace out. It's been the Vigilante Effect.